right, so manual techniques for the cervical spine in particular. Uh, the novice clinician is gonna be very kind of heavy footed, but we have to remember that anything manual related is very much total body. So Griffin here, as I'm going to do whatever technique I want to do for his neck, if it's mobilizations, if it's manipulation, it doesn't really matter. One, I gotta have soft hands. But at the same time, the setup matters. So I can't be all the way back here. This is not gonna be very beneficial. I gotta be in nice and close, almost right over his nose. That's completely fine. But watch what happens with my feet. When I go to set up to deliver either an assessment or a treatment, boom, I'm right here. Or honestly, what I like to do is step right around. So more or less, I'm straddling the corner of the treatment table. And now I can get into any position I want to with relative comfort. And I know that whatever technique that I'm gonna deliver is gonna be super effective because now my body is in position. As long as my body is in position, then the technique, all I need to worry about is speed. High velocity, low amplitude, speed.